So today I'll show you the best HRV monitor and cardiac coherence apps that you can buy. And I'll show you the cheapest way to get started, which just costs about 30 bucks. And then if you're willing to spend a little more money to get something better, I'll show you a more expensive option as well, which is the one that I use today. But let's start off with the cheaper version. And by the way, if you have no idea what I'm talking about here with cardiac coherence or HRV or any of this, um, I'll put a link down below to a video called What is Cardiac Coherence? And that'll get you up to speed. But basically, there's just two things that you need to do this. One is the HRV monitor and the other is an app that will analyze your HRV and give you some sort of coherence score. So let's discuss the cheaper option first and then we can discuss the nicer version at the end. But this HRV monitor is called the Kaito Fitness HRV. And it's got an ear clip here that clips to your earlobe. And it's got a light that flashes inside that it uses that to calculate how fast your heart's beating. And then here's the main body of it. It just connects um, through a little um, audio jack like this. Um, it connects and turns it on. And then this is the part that actually connects to your smartphone over Bluetooth. And it's got a little clip here so you can actually clip it to your shirt and then you're totally hands free. So then the next thing that you need is once you've got the HRV is you need an app to connect to. And so let me turn on the screen record on my phone. And there's a lot of coherence apps out there. You can see I've got a whole folder here on my phone of different coherence apps. I think I've got 11 installed right here. And I'm pretty sure I used to have more. But um, the best version and the best and cheapest version you can get is called the Coherence Heart Trainer. And this is created by the Complete Coherence Company, which is Alan Watkins' company. If you ever saw that TED Talk, Being Brilliant Every Single Day, that's his company. But basically, all you do is you would pair this, uh, the first time you're opening it, you would pair the, the monitor with the app. I've already paired mine, so I'm just gonna hit the play button. And you can see it's connected, and at the top it says the coherent score is calculating. And what it's gonna do is it's going to analyze my HRV and give me a score between zero and 100, depending on how wave-like and coherent the HRV is. And we've got a few things going on here. In the middle of the screen is a breath pace reanimation. And so this is going to help you to guide your breathing to keep that smooth rhythmic breathing, which helps you get a higher coherence score. And it's totally configurable. You can change the breaths per minute with this little slider. And you can even change the intervals of the inhale and the hold and the exhale. I'm just gonna leave it at the default for now. Uh, the next thing that we can look at is some of the heads-up displays that you get. And so here's a graph that shows you how your heart rate's changing in real time, and it shows you basically the last 60 seconds how it's changed. And you can see since I'm talking and making a YouTube video here that, you know, the HRV is not that bad. Like, it's decently wave-like, but it's not, it's not that perfect coherent pattern that would give me a really high coherence score. And maybe at the end of the video, I'll show you uh, a clip of me getting like a really high score here. But we've got a few different things. Um, if we slide to the right, this will show us our coherence score over time. And this is a handy uh, graph because this, is, this will really help you to get that really high coherence score because you can just look at this graph and just know is my score going up or is my score going down. And based on that, you can make adjustments and try to get your score to go higher or just keep doing what you're doing if it's working. And then if we scroll right one more time, we get the spectral analysis. I won't go too deep into this, but basically if you had a really high coherence score, um, you would just see one really tall bar here. Um, right now you can see that it's kind of a little bit all over the place. This is just part of the analysis of the coherence is the spectral analysis. Um, so that's the cheapest way to get started is with this Kaido Fitness HRV and the Coherence Heart Trainer. I think it would be a total of like 30 or $31. Now let's move on to the slightly nicer option. Um, and the next one is called the Inner Balance by HeartMath. And so this is another uh, wireless Bluetooth HRV monitor. It's pretty similar. It's got, a, it's got an ear clip and it's got um, the main body of it that has a clip as well that'll clip to your shirt. Um, one thing that's better about this 
and I'll just hold these up for comparison. Um, this is the Kaido Fitness here, and maybe you can see it's just straight plastic. And this can actually get somewhat uncomfortable on your earlobe. But with the Inner Balance HRV, it has a little rubber gasket around the edge, which makes it quite a bit more comfortable. The other thing that makes this one just a little nicer is it's got an on and off button with a nice flashing blue light to help you know if it's turned on. Um, the way you turn on the Kaito, the Kaito Fitness is just by plugging it in. So the one issue that, that you run into with that is if you forget to unplug it, your battery is basically going to die and you're going to have to recharge it before you can use it again. But with the inner balance, um, you've got a nice on and off switch. You've got a nice comfortable ear clip that clips securely to your earlobe and then just like the other one, you can just clip this to your shirt. Now let me show you the Inner Balance app, and maybe you'll see why I like this one a little bit better. So I'm just gonna hit the play button, and I'll take you through the different um, things that you get inside of this app. So right now it's scanning, um, go, ahead, go ahead and connecting, it says sensor found, and let's just scroll through these, few, these first few pages. So this first uh, page that we're looking at here, this is, I think they call it the mandala, but it's got a little breath pacer animation here. You can see that um, that little image in the middle is shrinking and expanding. And towards the top, you can see the HRV graph. Now I'm gonna scroll uh, one to the right and you get a different breath pacer animation. Um, basically, if you like that one better, you can use that. And now we're starting to get some reading on the coherence scores. And we've got three colors on this page. There's red, there's blue, and then there's green. If you've got a high coherence score, it'll show green. And if it's low, it's red, um, basically as you would expect. Now on this third screen, you can put whatever image you want. There's a settings screen where you can go configure this. And the idea here is that you can increase your coherence score by trying to evoke a positive heartfelt emotion. So you could either use this stock image that they put in here, or you could put one of your favorite Instagram dogs. You could uh, basically do whatever you want here. Um, but let's scroll over one more to the right. And so this screen shows basically everything that you need to know to, to monitor your HRV and work on your coherence. Towards the top left, we've got a coherence score between 0 and 10. Um, you actually can go a little past 10. I think I've gotten as high as 12 before. But overall, you're going to be shooting for 10 as the high score. And then in the, in the middle, towards the top, we see our HRV graph um, over the last two minutes, or maybe the last minute and a half. So you can keep an eye on how that's changing. We've got a coherence over time, which is a nice graph. Similar to what we just saw in the last app, we've got our spect spectral analysis. And then at the bottom, we've got our, our real-time heart rate. The other thing I like about the Inner Balance app is this review screen. And so it stores every session that you've ever done, and you can see how your score is changing over time. And so if we go all the way back to a year ago when I first started using this, we can see really low scores, really low average scores of like 1.9, 2.7, 3.1. But if we go to my more recent scores, um, we'll see quite a few higher scores. Now, so you see 5.2, 4.9. Um, there are some low ones in here. I was probably experimenting when I was doing those. But overall, the average is way higher a year later. And I can feel it. I feel like a totally different person being able to get these high scores. And I've been doing this almost every day for the last year. And it's been pretty life-changing. Um, a year ago when I started this, I didn't know how to manage my stress, I didn't know how to relax, but by continually practicing and using this every day and trying to train myself to get higher and higher coherent scores and higher average coherent scores, I've basically been able to take full control of my stress levels and anytime I feel anxious or worried, I can just come back to a coherent state and I start feeling a whole lot better a whole lot faster. So this inner balance is a little more expensive. I think it's about $160. Let me take you through a few more of the things that you get with this app. So I showed you the review screen. There's also a journal. So every time you finish a session, I'm gonna click the stop button so you can see. Every time you finish a session, you can put a, an emotion that goes with that session. 
So this is just another way to kind of connect your, how your emotional state is connected to your physiology. And the more you're able to mentally connect with, if I change my physiology, I change my mood, the more control you're gonna have over your stress levels. But with every session, you can select an emotion that goes with it, and you'll be able to store that long-term in the journal. Other benefits of this app are the achievement points. So in the top right of the screen, you can see it shows 82 achievement points. And let me actually go into a past session my goal usually is to, over a 20 minute session, to get about a thousand achievement points. And that would take an average score of around four for the entire session. And when I get a session like that, it just really sets me up to feel really calm and present minded for whatever I'm going into next. All right, so here's the guides tab. And so included with the app are a bunch of guided meditations. And so you can learn the quick coherence technique, you can learn the heart lock-in technique, um, there's different talks you can download. Basically, you get all these guided meditations and instructional audios to help you get the most out of this app. The last thing on the right is the Heart Cloud. This is their kind of social or their community aspect of this app. You can get a username and you can see where your achievement points stack up against the rest of the world. Now, the cool thing about the Interbalance app is it's totally free to download. The less cool thing is it, it's only compatible with the official HeartMath HR, Interbalance HRV monitor. And so this HRV monitor is about 160 but you don't have to pay for the app. You don't have to pay any kind of monthly subscription. You just pay the 160 for the HRV monitor and you've got instant access to the Interbalance app. And so those are the two options. There's the Kaido Fitness, which works with the Coherent Heart Trainer app and then there's the HeartMath Interbalance. Um, there's actually a lot more options out there, but these are just the two that I've found to be the best for the prices that you're paying. So I'm gonna put links to these exact products down below. And if you wanna learn a breathing technique that can help you get a really high score on these coherence apps, you can download my free ebook. It's called Breathing Secrets. It's gonna teach you a breathing exercise that is going to help you get a really high coherence score. It's great for relieving stress, great for relieving anxiety and with daily use, you can actually lower your overall stress levels. So I'll put a link to that down below as well. You can download it at breathingsecretsbook.com. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions about anything we discussed today. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.